Good morning, Sammy. Good morning, Nick. What's for today's video? Today is going to be a vlog with you and I, the Somerset Patriots. Oh my gosh. I love the Somerset Patriots. You love the Somerset Patriots? Yeah. Well, that's good because we have a lot of surprises today, a lot of fun things to do. I think I know one. What's one? Since today is Sunday, almost every Sunday we go to the Somerset Patriots, we run around the bases. You are correct. That might be one thing that we do. So, we have to get ready, get dressed, eat breakfast, and brush our teeth. And we're leaving for the Patriots in about a half hour. So, be ready. And are you excited? That's close to 9 o'clock. Yeah? Are you excited? I am so excited. Awesome. Alrighty, guys. Sammy, where are we? Did we make it? We're at the Somerset Patriots! We are about to get our tickets. We're going to enter. Sammy has a kids club event from 10 to 11. Uh, we don't know exactly what it is yet. I don't know, know what it is. Yet. We're so, find out. let's go have fun there, and let's go. Sounds like a plan. Uh, almost, almost. You ready? Let's go. So Sammy's events are done. We are currently waiting for the autograph session for the Service of Patriots. I finally found a quiet moment here without the music playing. We got some of the players warming up for today's game a couple hours in advance. Uh, we're gonna go down there and kind of watch that for a little bit. Get in line for the player autographs. And then I have a really cool surprise coming up uh, that I'm going to enjoy. One of my favorite parts of the day probably uh, in just a little bit. So stay tuned. It'll be really cool. And uh, yeah. Alright, it's okay. Oh, I still don't know. You need some You need some <laughs> Let's go. Alright, guys, so that's gonna end it for the vlog portion of this video. Today is actually Monday, June 10th. I am finalizing. Uh, this video, this vlog, and I'm actually summarizing a couple of things for you guys that you saw in the video as well. Yesterday, I went to the Sunday, June 9th game of the Somerset Patriots hosting the York Revolution. They held on to a 4-3 game to win and complete the sweep against the York Revolution. And then the Patriots are only a couple games back of the Long Island Ducks for first place in the division now. So yes, it was really fun, a lot of cool events, and it was really exciting a lot of waiting in line, though, which I wasn't thrilled about because, you know, I really wanted to sit down and watch the game and enjoy myself, but it was well worth it. I want to talk to you guys about all of it right now, and we're going to start off with some of the clips that you saw. So around 10 o'clock yesterday, my sister was able to get access to the field with myself, and we were able to go ahead and participate in, uh, like, games and stuff on the fields, uh, and that's for the kids' club. Now, the Patriots have the uh, Sluggers Club, which is pretty much... Uh, a group of young kids who paid like $15 at the beginning of the season to get all these uh, really cool perks. She gets tickets, uh, discounts in the store, she gets to do things like this, and pretty much it just is a great way to involve young kids. So she got on the field yesterday, she did some exercising with one of the best relief pitchers for Summers Patriots in their history, John Hunton, 
And then she did six different activities around the field. I was there with her. You guys saw some of the clips of that. She really enjoyed it. It was really fun. They do that a couple times a year. And I was happy to be with her. So from 10 to 11, that took place. Now from 11 to 12, there really wasn't anything going on. I just kind of hung out in the seats, watched some of the players warm up, uh, some of the pitchers toss and do their daily routines. And that was pretty much it. It was just a little bit of waiting. Closer to 11.45, I went down to the first base dugout. And every Sunday, the Somerset Patriots have their Sunday fun day events, which consists of player autographs and meet and greets. So it's the entire team out on the field sitting down. You go to one by one and you get autographs to talk to them, take pictures. You meet Sparky Lyle, who was a pitcher for the New York Yankees uh, years back. And yeah, it's just really cool. And then at the end of the game, you run the bases. We'll talk about that in a second as well. And Sammy was really excited to do that. We do that almost every Sunday we're there. I know a lot of the players. We both know a lot of the players by name. And one of our favorites is Scott Kelly. So I got online for that. And by 11.50, 12 o'clock, it might have been a little earlier, I looked up and this was the event I was waiting for. There was four New York Mets in the 1969 World Series attending the game yesterday. And you were able to go for a meet and greet and get autographs and stuff. And a lot of people knew about it. They've really advertised this. They've been talking about it for a couple of months, since even before the season started. And I looked up at the line, and it was crazy by then. Now, the event starts at 1, and by this time, it was at least an hour in advance. I think it was closer to 11.45. It was about an hour and 15 minutes in advance, and the line was already super long. So I went up and waited online for that while my sister went to get autographs uh, from the Patriots. And... I waited in line from 11.45 to 1 o'clock before the event even started. And then we didn't get to see the Mets until 2.45. So it was a lot of waiting. I was standing in line. My feet were starting to hurt. My back was killing me. It's like, please, let's just see these players. You weren't guaranteed an autograph from them. Like, it's you fine. just had to hope that you were going to make it up. Because they were only scheduled for a certain amount of time. I think they only had two hours to sign. And a lot of people were not able to get autographs because they were too far back and felt really bad for them. But I spent a lot of time and I was really excited. I actually attained, um, not attained, went to a similar event a couple years back and it was the 1969 World Series uh, celebration of the Stars of Patriots, the first version of it. And Mookie Wilson was there. I met Mookie Wilson with my mom, got some really cool autographs, took some nice pictures. That was really cool. So I met five players in the 1969 World Series Mets team and really cool. So my friend Matt ended up uh, making it to the game around 1.10, so I went to go get him, he stayed in line with us, we got some autographs, uh, and very limited pictures, it was actually a little upsetting, um, not upsetting, I was just, you know, I was hoping for something different, by the time we got up to the, um, the front of the line, it was our turn, there was actually Patriots staff members that kind of took our objects that we wanted signed, they gave it to the players, the players signed it, and they gave it back, they didn't really get to say hi, shake their hand or anything, they were on a strict time schedule, and you couldn't get one-on-one -on -one individual pictures. So they wanted you to waste no time. You simply gave them, or in my case, I gave them the picture. All four of them signed it, and I was on my way. I tried to take a couple pictures of them signing it, some selfies with me, and uh, two of the players signing it as well. They came out pretty good, but uh, not like Mookie Wilson. We got a full-on meet and greet with him. Got to, uh, got to spend some time with him, too, which is really cool. So this is the poster you guys saw in pictures of the players we got signed. It is backwards for you guys. We have uh, Art Shamsky, Cleon Jones, Ron Swoboda, and Ed um, <sighs> Cranepool. I always forget his last name. Uh, the compound words, they always get me. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so it was a really, really fun event, and I enjoyed it. We ended up getting back to our seats in the sixth inning. We watched three innings of baseball, then we ran the bases. Matt and I raced. I didn't beat him. He did not step on home. Um, you guys have already probably seen that clip from the vlog portion of this. But yeah, a really fun day. I had a good time, and it was really nice to see these guys. Big names that I've never heard of, because of course this was 50 years ago. I was not even born 50 years ago. My parents weren't even born 50 years ago. But um, really cool. They showed some great clips of these guys in action. And it was just a whole lot of fun. So guys, that's going to end this video. If you enjoyed it, remember to drop a like down below, comment, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching. If you guys want to see more Patriots vlogs, let me know down below in the comment section. I hope to be there a lot over the summer. And I want to get those out for you guys. So thank you all so much for watching. See you all next time. Peace.